guys, over here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 4 Module 4 Lesson 10 homework. So let's get started. Write an equation and solve for the measurement of um, angle X. Verify the measurement using a protractor. Alright, so let's see. Number one, angle DCB is a right angle. So I can kind of draw a mark to show. So we want to find out what X is. So we know a right angle is 90 degrees. So if this part is 35 degrees, then X needs to be something. So that X plus 35 is 90 degrees. So whatever X is, when it's added to 35, the sum needs to be 90 degrees because this is a right angle. So what plus 35 is 90? Well, 90 minus 35 is 55. So 55 plus 35 is 90. So x equals 55 degrees. 55 degrees. All right, now number two, HGF is a right angle. All right, so we have another right angle. Let's see, HGF, right angle. We have 62 degrees. And the total is 90 degrees. So 90 minus 62 is 28. So that means x must be 28. So then 28 plus 62 would be 90. So x equals 28 degrees. Alright. Number three. Angle JKL is a straight angle. Alright. So a straight angle. JKL is just a flat line. And when we have a line, it's automatically 180 degrees when it's just a plain line. So to find that, we need to do 145. That's how much this measure is. And this makes sense because this is an obtuse angle. So it's more than a right angle, which means it's more than 90 degrees. So we need to do 145 plus X would be 180. So 180 minus 145 is 35. So 145 plus 35 degrees is 180. So X equals 35 degrees. Now number four, angle PQR is a straight angle. So we have another line. So that's 16 degrees. And the total is 180 degrees. What plus 16 is 180? 180 minus 16 is 164. So 164, that means x is 164 degrees. Right, Write an equation and solve for the unknown angle measurements. Number five, solve for the measurement of angle USW. RST is a straight angle. All right, so we have a line. That means everything needs to add up to 180. First, we have 70 and 35. So we use 75 degree plus 35 degree plus blank. So whatever um, X is, it needs to add to 70 and 35 and make 180. Actually, so 70 plus 35 is 110. So 110 plus something equals 180. And that would be 70. 70 and 70. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Did I do something? Hold on, 75 plus 3. Oh, that is 75. That's 70, my bad. It's 70. So 70 plus 35, it's 105. So 180 minus 105 is 75. So our answer should be 75. Yeah. So that is 75 degrees. And number six, solve for the measurement of angle OML. LMN is a straight edge. So OML, again, 73 degrees plus 72 degrees plus x must add up to 180. 
73 plus 72 is 145 degrees plus blank is 180. If we do 180 minus 145, that'd be 35. So our answer would be 35 degrees. Which means X is 35 degrees. All right, number seven. In the following figure, DFH is a rectangle. Without using a protractor, determine the measurement of GEF. All right, so GEF. Well, let's see. Oh, man. Here, this is a right angle, and we're already given one measurement. So that's 74 degrees plus X, because we're finding GF, X is our angle measurement, equals um, 90 degrees, because a right angle is 90 degrees. 90 minus 74 is 16, so that means X would be 16. So 16 degrees would be your answer. Now number eight, complete the following directions in the space to the right. Draw two points Q and R. See, I'll do Q right here and see R right here. Use a straight edge, draw Q, R. Let's see, a straight edge. I think I have a ruler right here. Oh, it's a cute little cartoon ruler. So, draw the line okay and i think we should have arrows because it has arrows up there now plot a point s somewhere between points r, q and r so that means between that means on the line i think i'll do it right here in the point s plot point t which is not on q r t right here Draw TS, so connect it. Find the measure of QST and RST. QST, RST. Run an equation to show that the angles add to the measure of the straight of a straight edge. So we can't find the exact measurement without a protractor because we're not given a measurement yet. But it doesn't ask us to solve it. Really, it says find an equation to show that um the sum will be. 180. So do angle QST is QST plus angle RST is 180. So that's all you have to do. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps out my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.